Okay, so this is your thicker, larger bag, and the heat seal bar is 16 inches wide, so we're, we're pushing it pretty tight. You have nozzles here that will inject the gas into the bag. And this is a sensor style machine. So I have it set up to do about 65% gas. Um, uh, that's all right. So we're going to do 99% vacuum. The gas is 65, so it's going to devac the chamber about as low as I can um, to still get the heat seal bars to work. So here we go. And this is real time on a chamber style machine. So the first thing we're doing is evacuating all of the air. Send it back in for five seconds. Putting gas back into the chamber, so we're devacking the chamber by introducing the nitrogen into the bag. And when it gets down to about 65%, we should be able to seal it. And then the heat seal is going to go. Okay, it did a little bit better than I thought it would. Um, and you are just barely wide enough with these wide bags to actually get a good heat seal. So we're getting pretty close to the outside edges on the seal. Um, the 65% gave you a pretty soft pack. But I'm thinking with the time factor, 